Hello, people of God. I had a revelation of the Lord today I want to share with you. Last night I was praying all night and I went to bed um, around 7 o'clock in the morning. And uh, I was asking the Lord to reveal to me uh, more details and, you know, of, of the, uh, the, the sign of the 777 and the 300 days and the 711. And uh, so I went to bed around 7 o'clock in the morning, and at 2.22 in the afternoon, uh, I woke up and immediately to look to the, the clock in my cell phone, and it was 2.22. I was let immediately, as soon as I opened my eyes, to look at my, at my cell phone, and it was 2.22. And the Spirit of the Lord said, there is your answer. And I was like, there is my answer. 222. Hmm. Interesting. So I got to work. I got up, um, you know, started doing some research um, in front of my computer, and what I found, uh, you know, was incredible. Um, I've, I have known um, that, that the calendar, uh, the Hebrew calendar, was off by a month. And um, I'm going to let you guys watch. Um, you know, a portion of the video of Diana Olivieri that the Lord uh, told her in 2017, uh, 8-1 is 7-1. Hi guys, thanks for coming back to the next video. Um, I wanted to continue sharing information that the Lord gave me on July the 8th, 2017. That was a night that I received five dreams from Him. Um, this is the second dream that I am sharing, and the information that I received on this dream, I received it in the same manner that I received the South Pacific information um, through a dream state. Um, I was downloaded this information. What was given to me is this right here. 8-1 is 7-1. 8-1 is 7-1. And I knew it was in regards to dates, and I knew it dealt with calendars and time. And as I was pondering over this information that was given to me, I truly understood at that particular moment. It is true. The calendars are one month off. The Lord said, 8-1 is 7-1. And um, there's a few things uh, the Lord has shown me here. And they are all related. I'm going to start by giving you that from the last blood moon um, of 2015, the Tetra blood moon in September 28th, 2015, to the proclamation uh, of Jerusalem as capital in December 6, 2017, you got 800 days even. And it translates in Hebrew calendar. Two years, two months, and two days, 2.22. Two years, two months, and two days, 2.22. In the Gentile calendar, it's not, it's not two years, two months, and two days. But in Hebrew calendar, there was a year, uh, 2015, uh, in September, it was a year that had 385 days, and then the following year, 354 days. Uh, it's a total of 114 weeks and two days. Uh, the 114 weeks, they add up in Hebrew calendar uh, to two years and two months, even. And then the two remaining days, 222. When I woke up uh, at 222 this afternoon, immediately I thought of February 22nd, uh, you know, five days from now. And um, I did some research on that as well. And I found, after I found the the two years, two months, two days uh, from the last blood moon to December the 6th, uh, Jerusalem proclamation. Um, I found that from that day, December the 6th, to February uh, 22nd, you also have two months, two weeks, and two days. You also have a pattern of 222 pretty much from the Declaration of Jerusalem, uh, this is how relevant that was, uh, as capital to uh, the date, 222, February 22nd, you have two months, two weeks, two days. And um, 
which is two months and 16 days, uh, two weeks or 14 days, so the remaining two days, two months, two weeks, two days. And um, I was like, wow, this pattern is incredible. And um, so I started doing some research, uh, and um, I realized that, um, you know, the calendar being off by one month, um, that um, the beginning of the religious uh, or the biblical year, uh, Hebrew year, uh, in 2017, the year 5,777, did not happen in March uh, 27, 28th, but in April uh, 27, 28th, because the calendar is one month off. And um, when you do uh, from April uh, the 27th to the 28th, I even verify uh, where the moon was sighted in Jerusalem. It was uh, from the 27th and in the 28th. You count from there uh, to 22, 2018, February 22nd, and you have the 300 days. So from a triple seven, the year 5,777, uh, 300 days ahead, the following, uh, you know, complement of that sign, the triple seven and the 300 days. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you don't have to watch uh, the previous videos. Um, you have there 300 days, and then you have 70 days from, from that Nissan one, you know, April 28, 17th, uh, 70 days to the triple seven of July 7, 2017 were the sign of uh, Trump and Putin uh, meeting uh, and Putin being seven, 777 months old to the day. So you got 70 days in the difference. It seems that the triple seven has a confirmation of another triple seven and 300 days and 300 days with the, with the difference of 70 days. Um, one important thing that the Lord showed me because of the calendar being a month off, um, February 22nd, it is not Adar uh, the 7th, but it is Shevat the 7th, meaning it is 7-11th in Hebrew calendar. It is 7-11th. And um, therefore, uh, December the 6th uh, in, in 2017th was actually uh, Hesvan uh, 17th or Shevan 17th. Uh, the second month of the civil calendar, the 17th day, you know, uh, mimicking uh, the day of the ark. Uh, and and um, it's, it's got a huge re relevance because all these dates match uh, to perfection uh, when, you, when, you, uh, when you get the, the, um, the, you know, the months off and fix it. So... February 22nd, 222 is actually 7-11th in Hebrew calendar. Imagine that. So um, there is 70 days. So I, I don't know. I mean, uh, am I saying that the rapture will take place on February 22nd? No. Do we want it to happen? Yes. Do I think uh, it can happen? Yes. Do I expect it to happen? No. Really, I think, um, and I hope to be wrong, and you know, and this happens sooner in, in February the 22nd, it's perfect uh, to me, I'm sure for you as well. Uh, but I think it's going to be the 70 days later into May the 2nd to the 3rd, which is, is actually the true uh, resurrection day um, instead of being April uh, the 2nd. So you have uh, one month off, so when you bring that, you correct that month, it takes you to May, uh, you know, mainly the third day of, uh, uh, of May. When you calculate from the triple seven, July 7, 2017, you got 300 days even um, for the completion of the sign, the sign of the triple seven and the 300 days that follow. Uh, into May uh, the third, which comes to be the true resurrection day, Nissan 17th. It comes to be a, a 117th or 711th, and, um, and it's also uh, 70 days in between from the 222. Um, I think we have a... I mean, the Lord is the one that showed me this, so uh, I, I really have no idea. 
and when I checked all this, it all matches uh, even. It's amazing that, that, you know, from the last blood moon, you got 800 days even to that proclamation of Jerusalem, and um, the Lord showed me that it's a 222 also in Hebrew calendar, two years, two months, two days, and that when you actually add, uh, you know, until February from that very day, uh, December the 6th, 2017, to February 22nd, you also have two months, two weeks, two days. You also have the same pattern of 222. Um, I am, um, and, it, and it happens that it's actually 7-11th, because it is not Adar uh, the 7th, but it is Shabbat the 7th. Uh, in 2017, around July or August, the Lord showed me uh, this number, 11-12. And uh, He showed me the number three times. I did not know exactly what it meant. I believe this could be it, that, you know, the, the 12th month uh, in this Jewish calendar is actually the 11th month, uh, matching on, on a on a 2.22, being the 11th month and the 7 days, the 7 11th on a 2.22, uh, very relevant. And you see the relevance uh, from the last blood moon to the declaration of the capital, uh, of Jerusalem as a capital, uh, been 800 days, even in a pattern of two years, two months, uh, two days. And, um, and then repeating itself uh, from that very day to the very day or the very date of 2.22. Uh, I think it's simply incredible. You know, until now I was convinced that it was, that it's going to happen in the spring. You know, if it, if it will be in winter, then definitely this February uh, 22nd. I do believe that something will take place that day. I don't know what. I don't know if it's going to be the rapture. I don't, go, I don't know if it's going to be a judgment. I don't know if it's going to be uh, a war breaking loose or, or some kind of event, massive event, an earthquake. Uh, I don't know. But I think that when the Lord told me there is your answer and I did all these verifications and they match in an incredible way, I believe you got nothing... Uh, but to think that, um, oh, by the way, another matching number. So, so you go the extension of how incredible this is. So once you do the correction uh, for Nissan 1 in 2017 of the year, 5,777, being April 28th and not March 28th, 20, 222 days ahead, you land in December the 6th, 2017. So uh, you have a triple pattern of 222s um, that simply are, you know, are incredible because from 428, 2017 until 222, you know, February 22nd, 2018, you have 300 days, the 300 days of the, uh, you know, going forward from the triple seven. But you also have 222 days to... Uh, the super relevant 70-year uh, fulfillment of the declaration uh, of Jerusalem as the capital of Israel. If you have anything to add, you can put it on the comments. I, I believe that um, on the following 777 that comes from July 7, 2017, 70 days apart, uh, I believe that you we're probably going to have a 70 days uh, preparation time, super warning on this 22nd of February, if the rapture doesn't take place. And then on the second fulfillment uh, of the 300 days after the triple seventh, then the rapture may finally take place. Until next time, God bless you all. Shalom.